Hello well, my friends, today I am here for some treatment and a visitation. I'm at the Integrative Care today and a very interesting time. I'd like to share with you a couple of things. Come on, let's go together. One of the reasons why I wanted to shoot from this location at this point, I had a very incredible conversation with a good friend, Dave Crane. It really helped me to understand some things that I needed to hear and to start processing information that is a struggle to process. The reason I'm talking about that today is for, for many of us, there's information that's in front of us all the time. Google's flipping filled with information. You, you can Google anything you want. This platform is full of of advice, a lot of it very incredible, and some very incredible people. It's also full of, <laughs> I'm sorry, it's full of it. There is so much stuff out there that not all of it is even true or worth your time. And many times we spend our time in places that we shouldn't be. I've had to evaluate that in my own life. I've had to understand certain things that I don't want to talk about or deal with but the truth is, it's where the hard work is at, is where I'm supposed to be. Oh, it's hard right now, it's plenty hard. <laughs> the work I'm doing is plenty hard, but sometimes the work we do is as a result of the extra work that we shouldn't be doing. I'm facing that myself. So here I am at the cancer center, why? I've got cancer. I've had it for a long time. I've been fighting it for a long time been fighting things in my mind, my heart, my spirit, my soul, my body. I've learned much through this stupid disease that have taught me incredible things. There's so much that we can do. And I've been taught for a long time, years, that I have to have laser focus, have to know exactly what you're doing. And I've, I've been trying that, I've been working on that. Yet I've still been, I've been failing. And I have to realize some of the places where, where I really need to be for myself. So do you. I'm gonna be raw and real. You know, LinkedIn, Facebook, Instagram, all that stuff, and that kind of stuff is what's gonna deter you from where you're supposed to be. It's gonna, you're gonna be stuck in the muck of it. Is that where you wanna be? In the muck of a pile of shit? That's where we find ourselves, right, sometimes. I'm supposed to be dead because I've got cancer. They gave me eight months to live, check it out. I'm still here, there's a reason. I'd like to share that with you, you. You are the reason why I'm doing what I'm doing. You're the reason why I'm fighting and why I'm trying to do this. Now I will tell you that there are two priorities that come before you, God and my family, without a doubt. But you are the reason why I do these things every day. My family doesn't care about videos on LinkedIn. My family doesn't care about the different things that I'm trying to do to, to reach people with marketing and advertising and, and posts and videos. None of that matters to them. But me sharing who I am with you so that you in a position where you are thinking, I don't know that I can do this. I don't think it's worth it. I don't know how. You can. You will. You're not alone. Let's talk about it. Cancer sucks. I can promise you that. And my friend, I've been diagnosed with a terminal disease that I have to fight every second of my life. There's not one reason on this planet why you have to succumb to cancer in your mind, to cancer in your attitude, to cancer in your life. No. It's over. Flip out.